Hey guys, we're here at the pumpkin patch. We're gonna take a little Enzo. See us the pumpkins. Startled our eyes, we let go of disguise. I probably should have closed, or not closed, but like updated you guys yesterday on our pumpkin patch. <laughs> <laughs> He's like old enough to know that when I cut the camera or the phone or whatever, that like I'm recording him and he loves to look at himself. So you go off, boo boo. Huh? Te gusta verte? Si, en la cámara? Dile hi. Di hola. This is my mommy. Y acá está tu perrito Chewy. Yeah. yeah. Chewy. On the Chewy. <laughs> but yeah, it was actually really fun. And I'm actually excited because I feel like there's other pumpkin patches in this area. Uh, Dallas, Fort Worth, pretty much. And I think we're probably going to go to a different one. We didn't get a chance to go on the hayride. I wanted to, so that's why like the clips are not as long as because I we didn't go to well we didn't go on a hayride and I wanted to so that way Enzo could have gone. The only thing is it's hard when you have little kids. Okay, so if you have like kids underneath one, sometimes or may like majority of the time they aren't walking, so that's fine to be carrying them in a little whatever you call it. Which we did have it. We probably should have put it on. But Enzo doesn't say so. So, and he is underneath the weight of the 30 pounds of, you know what I'm talking about? The carrier like, that you have right here. So I think we probably should have done that because we didn't take a stroller. But I'm saying like if you have like little kids, you could probably put them on here or you could put them on the stroller. I don't want to take the stroller because he can walk and he's a kid and he can adventure. He was literally like rolling and trying to crawl on the dirt. I'm like... You go off, honey. You go off. <laughs> it's nice to have them, like, be curious and just, you know, be out and about. But also, it's kind of hard because sometimes you just want to be everywhere. So, you can kind of control them by having your shoulder. I think we're going to go to, like, another pumpkin patch because I really want to go on a hayride. And stop playing you too. They'll, like, rustle and stuff. But Enzo is actually, like, really teeny but also really big. He still fits in his six to nine month clothes. Like, I'll show you. Enzo, Enzo, hola, hola. We should be having a pediatrician appointment this week so we can get kind of an estimate of where Enzo's at and how much he's increased in weight or height in the past three months. I think he grew a lot more these three months than like any of the other months because he just is a lot heavier and it's, it's crazy to see him just be a whole human. <laughs> I mean, he already was a human before, but you know what I mean. This was a quick video because I was planning on doing my fall drinks in this video, but I'm probably gonna have to do it until 
next week. So I'll be trying out your guys' fall or favorite fall drinks. Please let me know um, if you have any other drinks I should probably try. I only have a few, but if you have any other ones, let me know down in the um, comments. I just, I want something that I haven't tried before and I don't really try a lot of drinks. So if you have any recommendations, please let me know or go ahead and go to my Instagram and send me all your recommendations. Also, I wanted to show you guys the boots that I got. They're like Dr. Doc, Doc Martens, whatever you want to call them. I don't know what they're called. But they're these. And I wore them yesterday. I just barely got them. But honestly, I completely recommend them. Like, hit up your TJ Maxx. They were only $29. And I was like, I cannot be spending, like... Ew, I have stuff. Enzo. <laughs> I cannot be spending, like... 100 plus on dr doc martens i don't even know how you actually say it but yeah save don't splurge i just feel like in general we have to be a little bit more careful of our choices and just spending so much money on clothes when truly if you just go to thrift stores you can probably find a ton of things too so i haven't actually gone thrifting but i've actually thought about it because a lot of people will be finding like really good deals and low-key jealous but yeah i did get that and i got a, a couple of yeah. other things but honestly i don't even have a lot of clothes excuse me i'll show you literally this is like all my clothes that's my underwear but i just got those new um sweaters those two and then this like my jackets um which i don't even know if i'm gonna use any of these because we're in obviously dallas but yeah this is pretty much all i have and then right here ignore it but i have like a bunch of t-shirts because that's like practically all i wear and then those are my jeans and that's pretty much it i low-key learned how to live like minimal because i got rid of all my clothes and i'm not mad about it but i also sometimes want to buy clothes because i'm like oh that's so cute but it's fine i just use what i have and i try to create different outfits with like very minimal pieces so Check out my Instagram because I do actually post them. I'm gonna, I'm working on a reel and I'll show that. But, anyways, I just wanted to show you guys uh, my outfit from yesterday, kind of like where I got the boots. In case you were interested, in case anyone cares. <laughs> anyway, so I think I'm probably just gonna close out. This is probably a quick little video. And until next time, bye.